the Cromwell B, the tier 6 medium tank today we look at. Our first replays from Roderick of the Union Clan, playing on Dynasty's Pearl. Thank you, Roderick. Mm, stat for you, bring it up, Bubba. This is looking at 2000 DPM, 145 pen, 160 alpha. Reload of 4.8 seconds, aim time of 1.9, dispersion of 0.326, shell velocity 785, depression 13, elevation 20, speed forward of 64, reverse of 20. The fuel range is 264, camo steel is actually quite nice, 25% and moving 19. After shot 6 and 5. Turret armour a whopping 76. So watch out for anything with a good derp gun. And hull armour 64. So if you like playing tier 6 and you do tournaments and things like that. I recommend you when this comes out on special buying this tank. It is a nice tank. Especially if you like lights and mediums. If you're heavy and the TD player, not so much, but if you want to learn, it's not a bad tank to learn in. But yes, it's definitely a good little tank for tournaments. Well, if you just like to chill out now and then, jump down to tier 6, have a bit of fun. It'll eat most tier 5s. But yeah, stay away from SU 100 Ys, SU 152s, those sort of things. They'll just eat this tank alive. So far, Roderick's got one shot into the Tiger, and that was a 153. Unfortunately, that one, yep, didn't quite work. Ooh, ouch. 348 damage so far. Nice little hole. Nice indeed. Up to 681. Make that 872 and bye bye. See, it just bullied that Skoda. So. Pushing around. Nice shot there. 1k damage. And don't forget, once I hit 2k, there will be another giveaway backed by Wargaming. So make sure, if you haven't hit that subscribe button, please do. 1,573 damage so far. 1,623. And two kills. Pushing around. Just that tiger to go. As long as that tiger's got that AFK to aim at. be easy to farm him. Nice high roll there of 200. And that is roughly where to aim at. Sometimes you'll catch the Tiger 1 on fire. That's where to aim at. See it damaged the engine. Another shot there if we hadn't repaired it. And could catch him on fire. Enemy One more shot. First to reload. And Roderick smashes him. 2,970. Wow. Thank you again, Roderick. 2,970 damage. Three kills. 42,000 credits. Nice carry. Now we've got Ozzy Mario Foil. G'day mate. Playing on Hellers. Or should we call it Hell's Ass? 
Okay. So he's actually got the legendary camo on. Which you can pay for a little bit of extra gold sometimes or that. Sometimes it'll come in the deal. So that's up to you guys. Watch those free ads if you watch on a mobile device. You save up enough gold and you'll get one of these little tanks. Won't take long. And usually these, the Cromwell B comes for a great deal. I've got one on both of my accounts on NA and Asia. Lord, behave yourself. So, so far, 929 damage, one kill. Pushing around the back. Ouch. Pick on this little pudel. And short work. Ouch. Up to 1,530 damage. Two kills so far. The damage just climbs pretty quick in this little tank. He's been very careful here to keep his hit points safe. One more shot and that bit should be finished. There we go. Up to 2k damage, this is the 2 kills. I'm still on 32 hit points. Enemy armor is hit. Nice. Still a pretty close game, 5 tanks compared to 4. But the other side's got an extra heavy. And bye bye. Another one bites the dust. Up to three kills, 2,484 damage. We didn't Not quite penning then. Guy was moving his turret around, so it made it a bit harder. We didn't their armor. Ooh, a little bit low, Aussie. I am a bit higher, that's it. to 2,825 damage with those three kills. And I believe Trap Lord's got the two kills so far. And just the one tank to go. Pushing around. Gonna get behind him. Cap points are very close, but the green's got both bases, so this should push it ahead easily a nice shot into the back of the Churchill up to 2000 make that 3156 damage oh nice land on top and destroyed him <laughs> good old trap lord never afraid to chuck it in 3156 damage three kills 65,000 credits nice job and thank you again everybody for your replays and I'll catch you next time May the force be with you. Bye-bye now. Mm-hmm. <laughs>